Friday, and I have been sucking at life for the past two weeks, just so y'all know. So, last night I did not close out the vlog. Ben got home, and I literally just uh, sat down, relaxed with him, and that's all we did all night long. I even had the computer in my lap. Didn't edit a thing. Go figure, right? So, um, I really need to get my poop together and figure out what the heck I'm doing with my life. Um, but for right now, I need to get ready for work, which um, I'm just going to throw on like a light layer of makeup, I think. I wish I could get to the point where I didn't need to wear makeup at work, but I just still am not quite comfortable with that. Update, I'm in my car, obviously. Um, so due to my recent weight gain, this jacket was kind of tight on me last year. I can barely get my arms through these freaking sleeves this year because I've gained so much freaking weight. Also, it is 26 degrees out today. It is super cold. And because I have that, um, what is it called? You know what I'm talking about. I've got a leak in my car with the antifreeze. I've got antifreeze leakage. It's slow, but it's certainly there. And what happens is my car will not produce any heat if it's sitting still. If it's moving, then it'll start to produce heat. But if it's not moving, no heat. So I did start my car and it got about like halfway warmed up. So I'm hoping that if I turn it on now, some type of warm air will pump out instead of cold air. We'll see. Oh, I don't know, it's still a little bit cold. All right guys, I made it to work. There's a car next to me, so I've got this really crazy angle. But I am here and I don't know where to put the camera and I'll update you guys when I get off of work. Update, so I am officially off of work. On my way home, I have a canker sore on my tongue. It keeps like grinding. <laughs> so I like bite on my tongue. So anywho, today went by really fast, really good. Um, I had some leftover chili for lunch today. It was delicious. My car is still cold. Update. So I am home. I have been home for hours now, actually. Um, I just haven't been doing anything at all, basically. Just kind of hanging out. Had a tummy ache all day, so yeah, that's fun. Um, but that's part of PCOS, I guess, just the fun of it. Anywho, um, uh, it is about 10.18. My sister-in-law came over earlier, and we talked about the tea party tomorrow. Showed her how to do some makeup and gave her some makeup tips, mainly on lipstick. She borrowed some lipsticks and yeah, um, Ben went and picked up this amp that's behind me right there and uh, um, he is currently over at his friend's house right now talking about guitar stuff. So yeah, that's basically all that's been going on around here. I am about to do some laundry and figure out what I'm going to wear tomorrow and that's about it I think. So I think I'm just going to call it a night here. Probably the first time I have signed off on a vlog in like a week and a half. And yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Good morning everybody and welcome back to the vlog. Today is Saturday. I am currently in the process of getting ready for the tea party that we are going to be going to today. Um, it's in about an hour. Where's my phone? There it is. So I need to hurry up and get ready, but I'm really excited to take you guys with. I don't know how much filming I'm going to be doing inside, but hopefully I can capture a little bit because I'd really like to look back on this memory. I think it'll be really fun. Update. So I'm officially ready. We are in the car. There's grandma. <laughs> We're both wearing like a burgundy. Oh, I'm wearing a burgundy color and she's wearing red. So we kind of match, which we did not plan that, but I thought that was really cute. So I'm really excited to see what the inside of this little tea place looks like. 
Um, I've heard it was really cute and I love little tea parties and all that kind of stuff so I'm really excited I'm excited to see everybody and like I said I don't know how much I'm gonna be filming inside but I would like to film a little bit because like I said this channel is all about my memories and being able to look back and see everything that I've done and the fun times that I've had so yeah I'm hoping that I have an opportunity or two to pull out the camera so um, we are heading there now and I'll update you guys when we get there. It's the story of my life. <laughs> Alright guys, we are officially here at the Mad Hatter and impressingly enough, we are here five minutes early. So I think that's a pretty good start to today. What color car? Hot. Goodbye! <laughs> beautiful Megan's lips look she did so good like I said yesterday we practiced some um, lipstick <laughs> techniques and uh, she borrowed a couple lipsticks and she's wearing one I absolutely love it I did it all on myself yeah so my grandmother is here my grandmother-in-law and my mother-in-law I like it Mm -hmm. I'm Megan. Last night I couldn't see that well and it looked so really, really dark. Depending on where the light is. Yeah. I just don't want to look goth. No, I think it looks really good on you. Good choices. So yeah, we're going to enjoy our tea and have a wonderful time. And I'm super excited to be here. And she's drinking mimosa. So yeah, we'll update you guys later. lined up over here. Everybody wave. Why are we posing? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Update. So we just got out of the Mad Hatter. It was so much fun. Goodbye Mad Hatter. Uh, look at the house place or whatever. It is absolutely adorable. I've wanted to go there for so long and so my wish has finally been completed I'm very excited um, yeah and there's lots of history to the house too it was really cool my grandma said that 
Um, my grandfather was possibly born in that house. It used to be like a one doctor um, uh, hospital and uh, there's a bunch of other history to the house and it's like it was built in like um, the 1800s like I thought I saw like was it 1830 or 1850 or something like that? 1836 I thought it was. Yeah I think that was like when the um, the first owners were so it would be very interesting to do some research on that house. I have, That's one of the things I love about Anoka is that there's so many old houses around here and you can actually do a tour of all the old houses which I would absolutely love to do sometime so on my bucket list but yeah so lunch it was absolutely wonderful the teas were wonderful I have a lot of energy from the teas and I also feel very like zoned out from it um, just like caffeine overload I feel like but yeah so we are going to head home and just probably relax for the rest of the evening Ben has a grandma go go oh. <laughs> sitting at a green light and she's just staring away um, so Ben has a um, band practice later this afternoon and then um, I think it's actually at 2 so like in an hour he has a band practice and I was asked if I wanted to go with but um, I don't know if I'm going to want to after having such a busy day plus my allergies have been acting up a lot lately and she's got cats that I will break out from much I know that for sure now so I think it'd be best if I just stayed home because I'd have to probably go there pre-medicated on Benadryl and then I'd just be looped up and weird the whole time that I'm there and if I sat outside the whole time I'd be freezing the whole time I was there and either way I'd have to take Benadryl before I got there so um, I wouldn't break out and then I wouldn't be able to drive so it just doesn't really seem like the best plan for me so I'm just going to stay home grandma's gonna go grocery shopping with Mike and I'll probably um, get my vlog edited and stuff okay so update I just got home and my new tripod came in so I can hold it out further it doesn't look so silly um, I, I don't know it kind of makes my angle look a little bit bigger I guess so that's not too bad not not hating it um, this is what it looks like in the mirror, just this uh, um, regular old tripod, sorry for the dirty mirror. So that's exciting. Um, only difference, or only thing I'm not too happy about is I thought it was supposed to like stabilize, like, you know, like when I'm like walking and stuff, it wasn't supposed to be so like, you know, whatever, it was supposed to stabilize it. Kind of like those like no spill cups. That's what I thought it was supposed to do, but um, it's not exactly what I wanted but it works now I can like set my camera down places like this and then I can like angle it up to me like hey and then look see no hands I don't have to hold on to it nothing like that so that is nice um, however I was really hoping that it would stabilize the camera while I was walking and doing like different area shots but that's okay, I have a tripod, so I'm happy about that. Um, I'm trying to get a hold of my husband to figure out what he is doing today. Um, I know that he has his uh, um, his thing going on today, but I don't know like if he's coming home beforehand or what the plan is there. So, I'm just setting the tripod up so I can take my jacket off. I don't know why I didn't take it off by the door, that was dumb. go hoping that he answers which he never answers my calls so wouldn't be surprised if he did not answer has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system I like to be annoying and call more than once twice maybe three times I don't know what's going on my fingers okay Update, so Ben um, is getting done with his band practice right now. Grandma made a chicken bacon um, Alfredo hot dish, so I just got done eating that. And then Ben called and asked if I wanted to go get some ice cream. So I'm just waiting for him to get home and then we're going to go get some ice cream. Hey, babe. What? Hi. Hi. Excuse me, I'm deaf because I was at band practice. <laughs> He's your water. Thank you. <laughs> We're not so good at, like... <laughs> I, I already got in the truck and came back. <laughs> We're not so good at, like, take two. <laughs> no. 
I, I, try, I tried to redo it so that the light was on and you could actually see what he was doing. <laughs> so anyways, how was your band practice? Was it pretty amazing? It really was. And um, our hands are shredded, our muscles are shredded, and I'm sure the drummer's legs hurt. <laughs> and it, the band, we could um, really be a good band, but we need a place, unfortunately. So what are we supposed to do, babe? I'm going to drive this truck off a cliff. Alright guys, so we just went to Dairy Queen. I got the um, Oreo hot cocoa. Benji got the, um, what do you call it, funnel cake, strawberry ice cream funnel cake. And both of them are absolutely delicious. I've always wanted to try the funnel cake at Dairy Queen, but I was always a little bit nervous that I wouldn't like it, I guess. But yeah, this is absolutely delicious. It was a wonderful choice. Update guys, so it is almost 11 o'clock at night. Um, because I took that long nap, I am just like wide awake, ready to go. So everybody else is in bed and laying down. I'm just going to work on some vlogs, editing some footage, and hopefully getting something up eventually. Um, yeah, but I'm gonna call it a night here and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night.